What is up guys, good old fashioned cola, back here for some more Pokemon Heart Gold. Uh, I made a big, big oopsies, uh, so, oh, repels effect wore off. So, I just have to go over a lot of stuff here because I ended up having to switch the drive that my video was recording on because I recorded an entire episode. We took down Bugsy at the gym, we talked to the Farfetch dude. We started getting through the Ilex Forest, a lot of things were covered, and I went to look at the videos and they corrupted because there was not enough space on my drive that I was sending them to. OBS gave me no warning of that throughout the entire process. I kept stopping and starting the videos even too because I had to keep making cuts uh, to jump away and stuff. So uh, unfortunately I cannot get back to fight Bugsy. Uh, but, rest assured, you didn't really miss much. I wiped the floor with him with my Quilava. The only thing that you did miss of note is I fought Savage right here outside of the gate to the Alex Forest. It was a very tense battle, and Quilava really had a clutch moment where he hung out with 1 HP against his Krokona. And I'm really upset that I lost that. Um, anyways, this is seems like a doomed LP, because everything that can go wrong is going wrong. I haven't had something like that where a file gets corrupted or I don't have enough space. I haven't had that happen since like I first started doing LPs like 10 years ago. Um, anyways, I, I mean that's just a reminder I need to buy a new hard drive anyways. I'm pretty much full on all of them. Uh, anyways, let's continue on in the Ilex Forest. We did talk to a guy up here. Once I get up here I will show you him. That man right there can teach your Pokemon Headbutt, which is a crucial feature in this game, because a lot of Pokemon live in the trees, so you can actually Headbutt them. I will show this off again. Quilava is the one that I taught Headbutt to. And I said a lot of the ones in the early game are like Metapod, Caterpie, Kakuna. They're not really worth catching or using on your team unless you want a challenge. Uh, but later on, there are some really, actually, really good Pokémon that live in the trees, so... Definitely, definitely. And Headbutt's a great move, too. Uh, I... Typically... I remember using it a lot in Emerald, uh, because I like to use, uh, Brelum as my, my grass... Pokémon. Is that it? For the Alex Forest? I thought it was way bigger. Let's talk to her. See that shrine that pays homage to our protector? This protector watches over the forest from across time. I think it must be a grass-type Pokemon. I mean, of course, everybody knows uh, who she's talking about. North to Golden Round City, the radio tower at Golden Round is giving away radio cards. Answer their question or receive a radio card. You a trainer? Of course you are. This is where I do my training! Now I'm, like, all nervous. It is capturing, correct? Yes. <laughs> this is such a cursed let's play. My uh, OBS is like, this is an Animal Crossing. What are you doing? OBS, I'm I'm trying, man. I'm trying to grow the brand. All right, we should knock this Radita out, and then Tentacool should be level 16. Then I don't even think I have like a whole lot of. Uh, a lot of USB ports left because most of my drives that I have are all like external. I have two internal drives and then two external drives. Oh, why didn't I switch? I guess it doesn't matter. Damn it. I even talked about. What did I talk about? I feel like that was the episode. I just keep recording these all back to back to back, so it's like hard to tell what I've already talked about, what I haven't. Uh, in case I didn't mention it, I've gone back and I've started rewatching The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy, which was one of my favorite shows personally as a kid. Um, and I'm just remembering how dark it was. Oh my god, can I get a Super Sonic? Also, how does Sandshrew know Poison Sting? I did not think that he could learn that. He's gonna instantly snap out, too. The Let's Play Curse. I think 
when I get to new towns, I'm just gonna start making save states. And that's like not even, uh, I'm not, I'm gonna keep saving normally, but I'm also going to make save states before like big events, just in case OBS decides to screw me over again. Because I've never had something like that happen, and I've been using OBS for going on 10 years now. Spiro. Um, I don't want to use anybody else. Oh, that's right, I did. I caught an Oddish because I thought maybe possibly down the line we could use Oddish. I, I don't want to use Vileplume, I want to use another evolution. I won't say what it is now. Constrict, please kill it. I think this is going to be my last episode of the day because I did tell myself I really should go try Starfield. I have it downloaded from Game Pass, and I am cautiously optimistic, like I said. Um, wow, that wasn't a critical either. I'm really surprised. But I'm cautiously optimistic. I'm really hoping that it's good. Whoa. That's it? Just whoa? You got anything to say? If you fail in practice, then you have to... Then you have to try harder. I'm aiming to be a gym leader. I'm gonna heal up Tentacle really quick. And we're gonna push on to Goldenrod. I think this dude's gonna wanna fight. I just got my Pokemon back from the daycare. Let's see how much stronger it got. Ah, that's right. You do pass by the daycare. That's a that's an option for Togepi. I think we're gonna do that. Oh no, that's Nubble. Ah, that's nice. I didn't know that. That makes my life a hell of a lot easier. I don't know if uh, Clearbody follows Tentacle to Tentacruel. Oh, I shouldn't have even mentioned the evolution. <laughs> Oopsies. Sometimes uh, skills like that, or abilities, don't... Sometimes the evolved form doesn't carry the same ability, is what I'm trying to say. But we took down Snubble. My end goal was to evolve, or not evolve, but level up Tentacle in this fight. But I don't know if we're going to be able to hang on with 22. HP. Ooh, nice, the, the Toxic Spikes. We finally got to see that in action. I think I talked about that in the last scrapped recording. Uh, I taught Tentacle Toxic Spikes. I'd see now I'm like all turned around, like, what episode did I talk about what? Oh no, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay. Please, kill that thing. Now I have to use another potion. And we didn't even level up. Alright, let's say... Uh, we're gonna have to use two. I need to plan ahead as well, because I need to know when our next team member is gonna be coming, gonna be coming available. I'm the best in my class at Pokemon. Are you now? Youngster Ian. That's something I can talk about. I don't think I've made an Animal Crossing video on it since they've reformed. Or maybe I have. But Smosh is back, and like, man, they are back with a vengeance because these sketches are totally classic Smosh. Like, the last one they just put out about uh, like, NPC streamers, uh, where Ian pulls out the fucking Sergeant and News character. I, I'd absolutely love to see it. BULLSHIT! Definitely, definitely Sergeant and News is one of my favorite Smosh characters. See, exactly, headbutt, one hit. And I think Quilava's gonna, uh, yep, level up. No, there are better trainers? His whole world's been shattered. Hmm, if you transferred into my class, I'd become the second best student in my class, wouldn't I? 
I want to get stronger before that could happen, so would you trade phone numbers with me? Then we can have Pokemon battles together. Sure, and I'll come back and... <laughs> to quote the great Reggie fils -Aimé, I'll come back next time and kick your ass. Grandpa! What are the odds that's her grandpa? Good work, Grandpa. The Pokemon you raised for me has been, been as healthy as can be. You look fit, too. Hi, Hogan. Let me introduce you. This is Hogan. He's a trainer. He seems to be getting better at raising Pokemon. Well, not as good as you, Grandpa, of course. Follow me, Hogan. Uh, you're gonna give me the whole rundown? Grandma, let me introduce my friend. This is Hogan. Aha, this is your boy, friend. I see. Hmm. What? Grandma? What are you talking about? He just happens to live nearby. Ha ha ha, I know, I know. Since you brought him here, Lyra, you must be sure about his talent. Right, Hogan? Come and see us anytime. Well, I better go now. See ya. Oh, I almost forgot. Here, this is my Pokegear number. Alright, I'll be sure not to call you, as I don't call anybody. You know, you can talk to your Pokemon as they follow you. They do all sorts of cute stuff on the road and in towns. I'm taking notes every time they do funny things. Give me a call and I'll share some of them with you. Grandma, don't you say anything. We're both trainers and we both and we're supposed to exchange numbers, that's all. Alright. I'm gonna give you my Togepi and then I am leaving. Dag him. Oh, that's cool. I forgot that you can see their sprites in the little playroom. Oh, come on, Gramps. I have an idea. I'll give you our numbers. And you can check on the Pokemon we raised for you. Oh, wait. Yeah, that is actually helpful. Calls from time to time when you... When you give us your Pokemon to raise, I'll be happy to have a use for this Pokegear my grandchild gave me. I don't know how to use the iPad. What's with you? What are you doing? Alright. Policeman Keith. Growlithe. Growlithe is definitely... If I didn't choose Cyndaquil as my starter... Oh yeah, nice. Making use of Clearbody again. Um, if I didn't choose Cyndaquil as my starter, and I think he might be Soul Silver exclusive, definitely would have chosen Growlithe for the team. I've never used a Growlithe before, but I know Arcanine is very nice. I think he was nicer back in the older gens. He kind of gets a little outclassed now, um, but still. Now I'm all worried about OBS, I have to check to make sure everything's... Okay, everything's good. I will not let the Let's Play Curse strike again. I swear. Alright, so we're gonna level up Tentacool. Level 17 now. You don't have to worry about the Knight when you're strong with strong Pokémon. I almost said strong with Pokémon. I feel like Tentacle's a little bit like he's made out of glass. <laughs> I feel like I keep having to heal him. Ugh. I'm confident in my ability to raise Pokemon. Wanna see? I suppose. Camper Todd. Psyduck. I like long for a time when I will fight something that is actually weak to Tentacool. Oh, okay, thank god, I was gonna say, you suck. Alright, you definitely suck. Because I don't think... can I use Confusion? Okay, I can. It just misses. Get him, please. Disable obviously does what it is namesaked after. I can't use uh, acid anymore for the rest of this battle. Or is it at least until Psyduck is dead? I can't remember. Please hit yourself. 
Thank you. I need a better move than Constrict, and hopefully I can find one soon, or Tentacle will learn one soon. Yes, knock yourself out. Didn't I train enough? Alright. Ugh, come on, man. I don't care. Whatever. As the game goes on, the Pokegear gets way more annoying. I feel like... I need, uh, repel. I refuse. I'm not fighting anything. Mostly because I don't want to use another potion. Embargo? Hmm. I don't know if that does any damage. I can't remember. I don't think it does. I think it just prevents Pokemon from using items on the other team. Yeah. Itch trainers also prevent it from using items. Well, why the hell would I use that? Goldenrod City, all right. Let me check the time. Pretty much, I think we're gonna wrap things up today, uh, considering we had all of that scrapped recording, which really makes me sad. I need to go back and make sure that the other recordings aren't ruined as well. Anyways, I'm Good Old Fashioned Cola. Once again, I apologize for missing out on Bugsy. Uh, if you want, Chugga Khan, where I played Crystal. <laughs> this is the same shit that happened to me when I played Emerald. I went through Emerald, I fucked up on a recording, something went wrong uh, when I fought Winona in Fortree City, and my exact words were, oopsies, if you want to see it, go watch Chugga. So I guess, oopsies, go watch Chugga fight Bugsy in Pokemon Crystal. It's not Heart Gold, but it is still in the Johto area. <laughs> Anyways, I'm Good Old Fashioned Cola, I suck at Let's Plays, and I will see you guys back here next time.